Hey everyone, Joe Burnish with BigWestMarketing.com. In this short video, I want to talk about the new name change that Google has made from Google My Business to Google Business Profile. Let's get started right now. So I'm pulling up this article right now by BrightLocal.com, very respected in the local SEO industry. And they're saying nearly a third of Google My Business users are unaware of a major rebrand. Okay, so I just want to make sure you are not unaware of this. I want everybody on my list or all my clients to be fully aware that it is no longer called Google My Business. It's now called the Google Business Profile. And I also want you to be aware that it probably won't have a big effect on your business other than you have to relearn the name and start calling it by something else. It's kind of a pain. But I don't think it's going to actually have a true impact on your business, but I want you to be aware that you may have gotten this email that says take action, understand the impact of new legislation on your business. Uh, another respected uh, guru in the local SEO scene, Mike Blumenthal, is saying that uh, Google is doing this to um, deceive you and enlist you to fight for them when it comes to this um, antitrust uh, issue. You know, Google could be considered a monopoly when it comes to local search because, what is it, something like 97, 98% of people use Google when they do a local search. And, you know, there's some, they're in some, some, they're having some legal issues with that, some antitrust narrative, and uh, they want you to fight for them. So this email and this whole name change, Mike Blumenthal says, are all related. I don't know the, the details of this and how true it is. I'm going to let you guys decide for yourself and if you really care or not. I'll put this link down to this article below as well. Um, but I just want to let you know that things are changing and Google is, you know, trying to recruit you to fight, you know, for them or at least be on their side when it comes to this antitrust issue that they're having. Um, but the big takeaway here is you don't need to do anything. I just wanted you to be aware that there is a name change. And if you hear people say Google Business Profile, they're talking about what is formerly known as Google My Business, which all of you should have by going to business.google.com and being able to see you know everything that you have on Google so that you can rank up in the Maps section. Okay. If you have any questions, let me know, but my name is Joe Burnich with BigWestMarketing.com, and I will talk to you in the next video.